Hey guys, so I'm here with Miss Jocelyn for our two month update really quick. Um, it's a little after seven right now, so I just wanted to get this done while I still can before I give her a bath and everything. Um, we are definitely doing a little better this month. Um, the fussiness has gone down like a lot and I think the probiotic has been really helping with that because um, she's had so much less gas and stuff like that so um, I think she's feeling better. Um, she's kind of squirmy now because I think she needs a little nap. But, um, but hey, you want to say hi? But yeah, so she's doing better with that and um, something I didn't talk about in the first one was sleep. Um, she is sleeping so well. Um, she, after less than a week home, she started sleeping basically through the night. Um, it kind of went back and forth as far as the time she would wake up. Like it could be anywhere from four to eight. <laughs> but now she's pretty much occasionally earlier. But most of the time she'll sleep basically until um, I mean, she goes to bed pretty late, but she'll sleep until usually at least 7-ish, 7.30, 8, um, usually around closer to 7. Um, so, yeah, so she sleeps really well. Um, so that's been for a while now, so I'm thankful for that. And then she'll go back to sleep usually till around 10.30 to 11.30 and then eat again. So that's really been really nice. Um, yeah she's growing of course but I don't know how much she weighs right now because we haven't been since her four-week appointment um, but she's got to be close to 11 pounds because she's definitely grown since last time um, I've noticed her head has definitely gotten bigger because things are getting harder to get over her head um, yeah so and like the sizing some of the children's place stuff like the zero to three is almost too short now, um, but the Carters have extra room in the length. So once you have kids, you like kind of figure out as far as like they run, all run so different, just like adults. Hey, what's the matter? What's the matter? Am I getting all red? Are you pooping? Are you pooping? Who knows? Maybe. <laughs> I don't know why it's so weird when she struggles so much to poop, but anyway, um, what else was I going to talk about? Um, yeah, so she's sleeping really well, um, yeah, she loves to kind of talk now, she'll kind of coo and smile and it's really cute, so I love that and it melts my heart every time, <laughs> um, but, and she's getting into her kick and play Fisher Price kick and play piano gym. Um, a little bit more now. She'll really, she'll start to like kick it and stuff, and it's actually kind of amusing her for a little bit now. So that can keep her busy for just a little bit, which is nice. Like if I need to finish getting ready or something. Um, and then she's up to eating almost. Um, she's up to eating six ounces at a time sometimes. Um, she was up to four in like no time. So. Um, yeah, I, yeah, so my mother-in-law just bought us a whole bunch of more uh, of the 8-ounce bottles. Um, we're sticking with the Lansano Mama. I think I mentioned that last time. It's been working best for her. Um, and it's the one slow flow that doesn't seem too slow for her. Um, she does good with it. Um, yeah, so... We're doing good with that. I'm still pumping, but she gets more formula now because my supply hasn't gone up any. So it's like two to four ratio, which kind of stinks. But um, yeah, so we're doing the baby's only organic formula. Um, and that she seems to do really well with that. Um, yeah, and favorites is something I wanted to talk about. Okay, the Boppy Newborn Lounger. Seriously, lifesaver. Um, she'll take short naps on it. She'll lay on it while I feed her. Um, it's just such a lifesaver. If you need to set her down, some like you can put it on the floor. Um, it's yeah, I just love that thing. So seriously, 
get you one of those. Um, I just love it. Um, something I wish I had done in the beginning though is put a blanket over it. Um, I have these little rack, like large or cloth type mini receiving blanket kind of things that were in like the diaper cakes that I got given to me and I have a whole bunch of these so I'll cover it with one of these and then I use another one to kind of like wipe her chin and everything and these are lifesavers too but um, the one thing I wish about that is that they would have put a removable, removable cover on it because she threw up on it a few times before I thought to cover it like every single time um, and these are also very handy because if she does throw up you have something bigger to catch it than just a tiny little burp cloth or bib and she likes to chew on her hand now too so she kind of drools a little sometimes too but I know there's no way she could be teething already um, yeah, babies just like to chew on their hand. Um, yeah, so she's doing good. She hates tummy time. Um, she'll just, I mean, she won't like scream, but she'll just like kind of, she just doesn't like it. She'll just kind of fuss a little bit. Um, are you still trying to poop? <coughs> but I've been trying to do tummy time a little bit, more, at least once a day now though. Um, because she is so strong, I don't want her to, like, delay her from possibly crawling early or something like that. Um, because she can push herself up and she can roll over from belly to back. So, yeah, she's doing so well. I mean, yeah. So, another favorite lifesavers have been, um, the Fisher-Price Deluxe Auto Rock and Play and the Graco Deluxe Glider. Um, the glider was a gift from my husband's cousin and uncle and cousins and the Rock and Play was a group gift from my church and both of those just lifesavers. Like um, most of the time she sleeps in her glider and then um, a lot of times she naps in the Rock and Play and they're just, yeah, I just absolutely love them. Um, so we have the rock and play in the living room, and then the glider in her room, and that just works really well. Um, and our house is small, so, like, what, whether she's in that one or the other one, like, I can hear her from our room, so it works. And, um, yeah, are you looking at the camera? I'm talking about you. And, um, yeah, so both of those are just lifesavers if you can't have if you don't have any way to get both I would definitely recommend at least one of those um probably the rock and play because kind of more like a little like bassinet type thing um yeah so and most of the time she's just in onesies and stuff around the house or like this little romper um because it's just hot um she gets hot even more than I do, uh, so she'll like sweat unless she's just in a onesie. So we really only do the, the cute little skirts and stuff to go out, sadly, but it works and less laundry to do. Um, and she's been in this one since I put her in it late last night, so yeah, but I'm gonna give her a bath and change her in a bit. Um, she does still have um, pretty bad cradle cap all over her head, um, so I try not to wash it too much just to kind of let the natural oils kind of help moisturize it. But um, a friend of mine um, who researched like kind of the best shampoos to help with that, so she has one she's going to give me. Um, so I'm thankful for that. Um, yeah. And she's got a little bit more popping up on her face again, but I just put a little bit more coconut oil on it, and that seems to help. Um, yeah. So, I think that's pretty much it for us. It is really hot in here, so I want to get back to the living room with her. Um, yeah. You're just going to town on your hand, huh? Let me say hi. 
face is all red. Oh, I'm sorry. You're getting hot. Yeah, you're getting hot. Okay, so we better go. It's about 78 degrees in here, so, so. Yeah, I'm gonna say bye. Okay. Um, that is it for now. Um, I did just start her own Instagram page, so if you don't have Instagram, you need one. Um, yeah, so you can follow her at Jocelyn Taylor Nosa with a dot in between. Jocelyn dot Taylor dot Nosa. And then you can follow me at Mrs. Hannah Nosa on Instagram. So, yeah. So, yeah. Anyways. Um, we better go, like I said, because it's really hot. And, um, as we get further along, I might not do these updates, like, every month. But, um, yeah, at least every other or something like that. But, anyways. Yeah, so there I go. I will see you very soon in another video. So, bye guys.